गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज स्टे ट्यून्ड साइक्लोप्स सी एन जी एवरी वन गुड मॉर्निंग दिस इज अमृतो फ्रॉम होम आई होप यू ऑल आर सेफ हेल्दी एंड डेफिनेटली वी आर वेटिंग टू मीट अगेन आफ्टर दिस पीरियड गेट्स नॉर्मलाइज टिल देन वी वी विल स्टे होम वी विल कीप आवर सेफ हेल्दी सो यू कैन सी आई एम यूजिंग माई रेजो बैंड लिटिल वर्कआउट इन द मॉर्निंग एज आई यूज टू डू सो मिसिंग माई जिम हियर सो एज देर इज अ चैलेंज एवरी वन इज गोइंग टू इज डूइंग इट राइट नाउ डेज एंड दैट स्टार्टेड बाई रितो ब्रोतो स्टे ट्यून द बाइक चेक चैलेंज सो हियर इज माई वीडियो टूडे एज वेल सो लेट सी बट माई बाइक हैव ओके सो हियर इज माई बाइक दैट्स बिटवीन रॉक राइडर फाइव फोर्टी uh it's a uh, one year uh, one month one year one month bike now i bought it on in the year 2019 uh so let's see what a uh, what we have in this so basically this is a uh, hard trail uh, not a hard trail it's a sports trail and it's a size of uh, large that's uh, that uh, that's people who are between a height of uh, 5.5.7 uh, till 6.2 can easily comfortably ride this so my height is within that so i bought the l supreme uh, so this is a 6061 uh, alloy uh, you can see uh, it's a heat treated alloy written over there heat treated aluminum t6 uh, we have a bottle cage we have a frame bag now basically uh, the body geometry has not been changed uh, there is no change in the body geometry uh, it's a 3 to 9 uh, 3 to 9 shifter bike uh, with uh, 11 is to 38 teeth at the back and uh, in the front it uh, I, i forgot so can't tell you now uh in the shifters we have uh, shimano shimano altus you can see shimano altus and in the front it's also shimano shimano altus <coughs> it's a model of 2018 2018 model so but uh, there is a change uh, in the crank front crank set there was a issue in the manufacturing uh, side uh, when i bought this so they changed it to the shram crank set and it's uh, holding pretty well no issues the first change that has been done is i changed from uh, the cage paddle to the platform paddle set uh, got from stay tuned thanks to rito broto it's a wilgo paddle set the th second one is this frame protector because when we ride uh, in rough trails we have a bounce in the chains and that goes and uh, hits the frame body so to protect that body from getting scratches and uh, the colors getting tinted uh, definitely use uh, as a home base uh, solution of taking uh, inner tubes of any cycle and wrap it very tight with uh, zip ties and you can also use uh, two three drops of fabi quick so that they can stick together now on the other hand uh, it has in the front and back it has got uh, uh, disc brakes from uh, between tech uh, between it's a tectro you can see it's a between tectro hydraulic brakes uh, so one year i'm using this the pressure of the oils are still good but uh, planning to drain it now has to so rito broto you have some work to do i will get you i will this mention this at the end and it has got a suntour xcr uh, evo 100 mm uh, fork traveler with uh, lock options and uh, weight adjustment uh, this is a, a this is not a air suspension this is an oil suspension so it has got a overload uh, overload uh, preload weight uh, sorry preload uh, weight adjuster uh, as per your body weight you can adjust this so that the shocker uh, travels as per your body weight uh, now the third thing i have done is that uh, 
this the change of the grips uh, the grips was like push grips uh, the company factory stock I have changed this to a uh, uh, normal uh, uh, a stylish one it's a uh, lock so you just have to unscrew it uh, from here and it will uh, remove it it will be removed now the shifters we have over here both are Shimano shifters uh, stock shifters no changes done so uh, we the third one is uh, we have a GPC handlebar and this handlebar was bought from stay tuned Rito Broto uh, so this is a 700 mm of handlebar alloy straight flat handlebar uh, previously it was a stock uh, handlebar with 620 mm alloy uh, I have changed that uh, now uh, let's move to the wheelbase uh, on the wheelbase we have uh, Aero Trail Evo alloy wheel uh, it's a 27.5 wheel on the both sides and uh, the change over here what we have what I have done is that uh, the front and the back both uh, it was a shredder tube uh, somehow this uh, front one uh, got, Sorry front or rear. I don't remember it got damaged and I changed it to a presto and to be honest uh, I am feeling the change of a presto because uh, I Do not have to push air in it uh, uh, for, uh, for regularly or uh, in a week as well because I remember that I gave it a month ago and it's still holding very tight so that's uh, that's a very good thing on uh, Presto and uh, the tires we have on this uh, are between all terrain tires uh, using it for uh, quite a long one year now and to be honest this is not absolutely a uh, road or a sprinter tire you cannot go for a sprinting uh, or a chasing on these tires because it has got blockheads so but this is very good for trails and uh, you can uh, definitely uh, use for some little stuffs like um, slidings uh, and then uh, uh, doing other uh, on-road uh, some little bit of cycle stunts not too heavy because these cycles are not for stunts and these tires are not for stunts so that's all we have over here as uh, my bike uh, okay the other one is uh, the seat we have a memory foam uh, seat cover on it and the seat is basically a between stock seat Argos uh, foam uh, stock seat but I am planning to change this because uh, I have to go for a comfortable seat now uh, it's been long uh, I was waiting for that seat so here uh, the third one that uh, the change that I will be doing and I need help from stay tuned is that uh, changing the handle steam I will go for a shorter steam uh, closer to the body uh, or body frame of the cycle uh, there will be a change in the geometry definitely so that one will be done uh, later we will uh, post it that as well and over here uh, so this is all what I have in my bike and the changes